everyone and welcome back to the Zeus Daz Animated Retro Game Channel. I am your host, Zeus, and it is shit game time once again. Um, yes, what have we got this time? Dragon Ninja on the Commodore 64. This has been pay requested by YouTuber Northlander. Hope you're doing alright mate. Thanks for very much for your request. He wants me to banish this in the poop tube forever. Doesn't think very much of it. I played it a lot back in the day. I even own the original tape. Uh, it's not too bad but it's very glitchy and very buggy in certain areas and i've even let's long played it which is a full commentary uncheated long run uh, play run of it so check that out on my channel and i've even fi uh, featured it on the 8-bit challenge as well if i remember correctly that aside let's see what information we've got who was it programmed by uh, david collier graphics by stephen wahid and john palmer and I think that's all I've got. And it was published by Imagine. And Imagine, Stroke Ocean, one of my favourite uh, computer houses, software game houses back in the 80s. Much far superior than US Gold, in my opinion. Uh, what's the price tag? £9.95 for cassette, £14.95 for disc. And it came out a few years after that for £2.99 on a budget title. So this game, that game came out in 1989. Music by Jonathan Dunn, you can see that. And the total screen music, yeah, it's pretty good. However, don't think much of the in-game music because it's the same boring thing. Uh, we'll see that in a minute. Let's, uh, let's just crack on with it. Uh, press that button there. There we go. Now, gone is the two-player mode. And I remember one thing. It's... Well, I remember two things. Well, three things, actually. Number one, very dodgy collision detection. Number two... You can usually complete the game with just a jump and kick move like that, which is pretty lame. And more importantly, number three, and I don't know if you'll see it here, but on later levels it certainly happens. It's very buggy, very glitchy, to the point that the ninjas, they can sometimes just disappear off the screen for no reason. They just disappear. I've got a knife now. So you want to see about the tune, it's the same dum 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 it's like that throughout the entire game can get a little bit tedious but collision detection is yeah not brilliant i have completed this game without cheats and i've also i featured that on a let's long play and for those that don't know what a let's long play is it's me completing a game with full commentary without cheats and this is on there on my let's long play section um it's not bad. I mean, the forums, a lot of people on the C64 forums seem to think it's okay. Could be a lot worse. I mean, the graphics are quite pretty and nice. Reminds me of Target Renegade. But it's a very glitchy game. See, look, that. do you see that ninja just disappeared? That's exactly what I'm saying. He just vanished. And he's not got bloody magic spells. It's not part of the game. Get off me. Um, that is a terrible glitch. It's very buggy. If you want to play a home boot. Oh no, come on. Get, no, let me get out of the way. I want to get this can of Coke. Oh no, it's, it's not going to let me get the can of Coke, are you? I knew it. Now you will let me get the can. There you go. What a surprise. Now I get it when I don't need it. Look at that. It's just... Urgh. yeah it's very glitchy uh, but yes as I was about to say the home version home new, uh, version you want to play if you haven't got the arcade main version whatever it is Mega Mega it wins it hands down and I've still got the original release in its full big large cardboard box of Dragon Ninja on the Mega in my attic mint condition if someone's interested in maybe purchasing that, maybe you can contact me. I might be willing to sell it. It's not a crappy budget release. It's the original Imagine Big Box release. Here we go. Again, same thing. 
could have done it. I mean, really. It's a bit lazy, isn't it? But yeah, you find yourself jumping around all the bloody time. It's very glitchy. There it is again. But yes, yeah, so I've completed this quite a few times. The uh, Spectrum 1 to 8 boost is pretty good. And so is the Amstrad. If I remember right, the Amstrad's got some speak in it as well. Yeah, the Amiga version is, is the best. I can't pick up the bloody nump. There we go. No. Yeah, it's, uh, I mean, it's okay. It could have been worse, personally. It could have been worse. Jesus, you might. Look at that ninja looking at the top right. Right, he's completely glitched. Look at that. <laughs> there you go. I'm not lying. This game is very buggy and very glitchy. Look at him. <laughs> he's just levitating. There he is. Whee. <laughs> okay. Again, same move, just jump kick. That's all you gotta do. That's all you gotta do. Oh. oh, he's gonna win this fight. Oh no! I think he is after that mistake. Come on, who's gonna win? Oh, no, no, no. Yay, I did. Okay, level three. Seven levels altogether. The forest level is the most buggiest out of the lot. They vanish, disappear off the screen like crazy. Um, it's just so glitchy. So they definitely didn't do any final checks. I don't think they probably got it out for a Christmas release or something, maybe. And sometimes it's very hard to pick up the weapons. Um, but the, um, the, the the green one just disappeared. So, and that, but look at them, they're all disappearing. And she is. Look at them. It's like a, a vortex in, the, in where the ladder is. They're all just disappearing. <laughs> no excuse for that. It's terrible. Very, very glitchy game. Yeah, just could have done with a few final checks, couldn't it, lads, before you released it. And a couple of more different tunes wouldn't have gone amiss. But, oh, that's really glitchy, isn't it? Um, and this is not a bad download. This is my original, because I am the original, uh, Imagine release of the Spectrum version, the Commodore 64 version, and the Amiga version. And this is the Commodore 64 version, original, running off my hardware. So it's not a bad dump. But it plays like a dump in certain places. See? Get the coke. Look at this. Look. Look, 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 look. It's not even letting me pick up. I'm going to get screwed out of a life here. Look, see? It won't even let me pick up the can a lot of the times. So and now it probably will. There you go. I noticed that. I remember that as well. When you really need it, it suddenly just doesn't let you pick it up. Is he coming down on the top left or is he being a chicken shit up there? Look at him. He's just waiting, isn't he? Oh, come on. Yes. I don't care what anyone says. This, this should have been checked a lot better. It's very buggy. I can't... Urgh. This is red guy. He's been a right bastard, hasn't he? Got him. Look at these guys. They're really glitched. I'm going to stay there. Uh, yeah, and there's the also the um, the cave level I think it is level I've got look look at him hanging up there the cave level uh, you can make your way right across the end of the level without even fighting anybody so glitchy I'm just gonna make my way over look, here we go you shouldn't be able to do this. Right, 
Alright, where are you? There you go. Oh. Oh dear. And you got your super punch. There you go. Just did it. Look at him, he's walking in there. Oh dear, what a glitchy game. Well, that's not fair. You can lock and just multiply, and I can't. Oh, look how glitchy that is. It's, <laughs> it's laughable, isn't it? Oh, next level. So, uh, a little bit of loading, eh? I, I think. Yes, here we go. So, we're waiting to see. I don't know how long this takes, so we'll, um, we'll cut off for a sec. Oh, no, we don't need to. There it is. It's a quick load. That's good. So this is the forest level. No, it's the next level. This is really glitchy. Really, look at that. It's just terrible. And suddenly, all the ninjas look really washed out in colour. I'm <laughs> just jumping around. Ugh. Go away. Look at them, they're just glitching like crazy. Oh, here we go, see I can't, come on. Sometimes it just won't let me pick up anything sometimes. It's so glitchy, there we go. Another, <laughs> it just vanished. Definitely should have had a few more checks before the release. Glitching like cr oh, that's really glitching up now. Yeah, I can't seem to bloody get any of these guys. It's this bitch, I want to get this bitch. There you go. She's she's the one that's causing me problems. No, there's no point. I won't be able to get this while I hit it. will kill me. See, I'm on my last level energy again. See? E boom, boom, boom. Yeah, did I get it? No, of course I don't. Now I'll be able to pick it up. Probably. It's just so glitchy. Why can't I pick this damn can up? Thankfully. So bad. Ugh. So glitchy. I don't know if anyone could really enjoy this. This is not the, the, the best version out there, is it? Because of all the glitches. They're just disappearing and look, that red ninja just vanished. They're all vanishing on me. <laughs> I'm not even able to kill them. Look at them. They're just they're just disappearing into a new universe for no explanation <laughs> but see I can't I just can't get these I can't it won't it won't let me pick these things up it's so glitchy I can't I can't even pick these things up and I'm gonna die now Bitch, I've got to get rid of this bitch. She's trying to kill me. Yay, I actually picked it up this time. God, when's the end of this level? This is a long level. No, I'm timing it wrong. Oh. oh, it's so bad, isn't it? God, I'm 
much more. I'm just trying. <laughs> Thought we near the end of level now. Christ. Oh, that's him, isn't it? No, it isn't. Right, we're at the end of level now. Right, bloody hell. Oh. Oh. Come on. Come on. Ah. Oh, it's just, it's very hard to play. Oh, is that it? Game over. Time ran out. But that bloody level was huge. Well, that's about it from me. I'm not going to play any more of that. I think we've got the idea of what it's like. The bottom line is, it's extremely glitchy. Um, yeah. The ninjas just disappear. It didn't have enough checks, did it? Enough um, play testing going on. They must have rushed out at the end. Imagine had a few things like that, didn't they? Imagine Stroke Ocean for the Commodore 64 especially. I mean, I remember Robocop had a serious glitch on it, didn't it? You couldn't even pass a level um, later on until years later it was we um, it was looked into homebrew-wise. Some guy had checked it out and got into the code and corrected it. And now it's an unbugged version release. But yeah, this this is doesn't play very well. I mean, I like the title music, no doubt about that. So well done, Jonathan. Done there. But pity it's only got one tune throughout the game. The two-player co-op mode has been removed, and um, collision detection is bloody awful. It's very hard to pick up the items when you desperately need them. The price tag is on the pricey side, especially for the disc, nearly 15 quid. And um, yeah, you're certainly not going to get the arcade game, are you, into a Commodore 64. I understand that. I appreciate that. But it doesn't mean you should be releasing games with glitches like that. And, and on top of that, charging £10 for the tape and £15 quid for, the, for the disc. You know, I don't care what pressures there are, release dates and time getting them out. You should not release games with glitches like that. So... Taking all that into consideration, I'm afraid I'm going to have to give it a... I'm going to give that 76 shits on the shit hunter for Dragon Ninja on the Commodore 64. As I said, the pluses, great title music. Uh, graphics, quite pretty, colour, um, nice colour, um, very bright. But that's about, that's all, oh and of course the ocean loader, can't forget the ocean loader can you? But apart from that, the negatives, long loading times, glitchy as hell, buggy as hell, same music throughout the game, two player co-op mode gone, so the negatives outweigh the pluses. So I'm going with that, 76 shit, some of you might agree it could be even more, some of you might say no it doesn't deserve that much, I think it's about 76, I think that's about fair, this version of Dragon Ninja. Please let me know in the comments if you agree or not, whatever. I always like to read your comments. And don't forget, please get those um, shit game time requests coming in. The door's still open. Video will come up in the top left. Follow the instructions. Click that video. It will also be in the link in the description and pinned at the top of the comments so you know what to do. So if you've got a game back in the day that caused you pain, then give it to me. Your life's not in vain. I'm judge, jury and executioner because we didn't have a judge, jury and executioner back in the day when we should have children instead. All those kids got pretty much screwed and a lot of games out there should not have seen the light of day releases. But they did anyway. That's my job. So, yep, get those requests too. Thanks again for joining me for this edition of Shit Game Time. Take care everyone. Please keep tuning in and tune in definitely next Friday for the next edition of Shit Game Time. All the best. Zeus. Out of the shit's behind.